What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another another boss, and I think this is the last boss of this uh, of this rotten lower hinter tomb chalice, I believe. So <laughs> let's see who it is. Ah, the Myria descendant, or the Elder, who knows? It's the Elder! Sup, Elder? You got a bow? Oh my god, he's got that strap for real, for real shit! Hey, yo! Please, calm down, sir. I got you this time. I got you this time, sir! What? See how easy he is if you just fight him? If you don't try, try to uh, do viscerals on him, he's... If you don't do viscerals on him, he's actually really easy. Like for these guys, I know how to fight them. They're, they're not bad. It's just that I'm trying to visceral so I can get more blood echoes from them. I just focus on like... Doing main damage to them first, I guess. Very well, good sir. Whoa! Man's going Gatling style on my ass. Sheesh! Stop it! You wanna play this game? Are you sure you wanna play this game? Very well. I said you shouldn't have played that game, but you played the game, sir. <laughs> Man howls like a wolf. <laughs> Crazy. Well there you go, the mirror descendant. Easy boss, lass! Easy boss. Man. Hmm. Maybe I am a little over leveled for these Thamiru chalices, I don't know. The cursed chalice definitely uh proved to be challenging for sure. It's the one with the uh, the amygdala. Like that one was insano. Uh, did I gain anything better? Doubt it. It's quite doubtful. Something for bolt. Something for thrust. No, thank you. Yeah, we got nothing good. You know what we do with these uh, gemstones? Oh yeah, good advice is to always sell them if they're. Uh, if they're not good for your character, just sell them. Uh, attack versus Ken is down. The ones that says attack versus Ken is down, those ones you want to keep. Attack versus Ken or attack versus Beast. They're very, uh, they're very useful. This one I might keep because it takes away the, incre uh, it increases stamina cost. Attack versus Ken is down. Yep. Don't want you, sir. Actually, no. I don't need. I don't even need any of these, actually, because they're not even better for my weapon. So. No point, sir. Never sell Carol runes. Whatever you do in this game, never ever sell Carol runes. Big mistake. You're gonna want to keep all of these, even if they're, even if they're like shitty. There's like 50 million of these communions right here. God damn. I don't know what they're they're actually for. I mean, they're obviously for increasing maximum vials, but like, I don't know why there's four of these. There should only be three. A max of three for each of the Carol runes, but there's four for some. There's five for some. I want to know where I can get this, the, the best uh, claw mark, and I want to know where I can get the best air. Because I, I want to live, bro. I need, I need, I need air, bro. I, I want to live. So I need to find where the best air is at. And... 
in the best eye, I guess, because of uh, item discoveries. The best metamorphosis is good. The best anti-clockwise metamorphosis is also good. Just a bunch of that shit. So let's see, which one do we make? Uh, we went to this one, the rod of the lower... The rod of the lower, so we did this one, the root chalice for this one. Which was actually f uh, fetid and rotted. But if you... Uh, I don't know how it actually goes for this. Like, even if I were to put this and this and then create the... And then conduct the ritual. As soon as you get inside of the... The root chalice, it'll only say one of them. One of the three or one of the two, whichever you pick. Which in my case, I'm picking all of them and then going through the rooted chalice only once and never again. I guess I could go to this. The sinister hinder tomb root chalice. Which means I think the sinister... With the sinister bell, I think the girls, the ladies, comes into play. The the bell keepers, whatever they're called, the bell writhing keepers. But we also got... We also have this to do, Jesus. The defiled brute chalice. Here it is, curse. So for these I'll go this, this, and this, and then conduct a ritual. Oh my god, this, this right here... This right here is hard mode at its finest. Let's go. So we'll do that one first, then we're gonna delete this one. And then we'll go to... I need 4 red jelly and 25 arcane haze. So let's go get... Uh, what, was it? what was it? What was it? What was it? What was it? Red jelly and arcane haze. Red jelly and arcane haze. Red jelly and arcane haze. Let me buy a red jelly first. I needed four. Red jellies. I don't have it. It can't be purchased from the pool. Can it be purchased here? Nope. Alright, so I can't really do that one yet. So instead, we're gonna go ahead and go here. Go to the Hinter Tomb, and then we're gonna need to go to this one, the Sinister Hinter Tomb Root Chalice. Requires 19 Arcane Haze. So let's go to the altar. Arcane Haze. It requires 19. I only have one Arcane Haze, really? Sheesh. Jesus. I'll extract one of you. Yeah, one of you. So now my 13. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. I need six more. I'll extract. Hold on. I need a six. Um, I guess I could go like this. Use three to get uh, six in return. There we go. Beautiful work, lads. Absolutely beautiful. Go to Sinister. Go to the Sinister Bell. And now conduct. And then for the next one... Um, it should be this one, but since I don't have the red jelly and... Since I don't have red jelly, I'm gonna have to put something else. Uh, I believe I didn't do any of the Ailing Lauren Root stuff yet. Or even this one. I think I only went to the very first one where we fought the Abherent Beast. I think I died like two or three times to the Abherent Beast. I can't remember. But we haven't done any of these ones yet. I need, root, I need the Ritual Blood 4. And then for this... And then to get the, the fetid and the rotted, I need five inflicted organ and I need three sages hair. I guess I could go to the lower Lauren, I guess. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Might as well. I'll fill all these altars and then I'll start from like all the way from the bottom and work my way to the top. Let's see what we got next. 
I guess we could do Great Izzy Chalice, but I don't want to go too far. Yeah, since I can't really put anything else on these chalices, I guess these three are the only ones that we're going to have to do. We're going to start with this one and then make our way up to the very top one. And if we can get the red jelly, then we can start the the great uh, Thamiru Iri Hill chalice, which goes to the... I think it's the last one for the very first... Um, for the very first chalice, which is the Thamiru. I think I think great Iri Hill, or Iri Hill is like the last for the Thamiru. It's part of the Thamiru Iri Hill. Um, I know it's confusing as hell, I know. <laughs> it's super confusing. But uh, there you go, guys. That is the boss. We fought uh, Thamiru Descendant. Or no, it was the Thamiru Elder. He's pretty cool of a boss. That man, yo, that, that guy got the guap, bro. He got the guap for real, for real. Anyways, I'll see you guys at the next uh, boss. Thank you for watching.